I'm still pissed that you didn't warn me about those drone guns, you know. Ah, oh, come on, Dr. C. I thought we were past this. I could have been killed. Don't tempt me. Sound the alarm. She's here. Fucking shut up. Oh. You're next. Oh. You fucking good-for-nothing laptop. No, I'm just kidding, Dr. Carol. I couldn't possibly kill you. The fucking game won't allow it. Hey, who turned out the fucking lights? Hello ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the third installment of Let's Play Perfect Dark. In the previous episode, we fought our way through the Datadon research labs and retrieved the valuable but extremely annoying Dr. Carol. And now we are going to get the fuck out of this building, and we'll start by fighting our way through the foyer to the elevator, which just so happens to be our first objective. Hey, who opened that door? And what's that over there? Go, go there. That would be me, you fucking idiot. Ow! Well, I can see you too, cockhead. Now, I'm really not a fan of this mission, for two main reasons. The first being that fucking annoying Datadyne gunship that always circles the building and strips health off you like fucking crazy when you're trying to get from point A to point B. Sometimes you're lucky and it doesn't bother you too often. Other times, it can punish you pretty fucking hard. Ah! Uh, son of a- oh, Fuck! The second thing I hate about this mission is fucking Dr. Carol himself. As if he wasn't already annoying enough. He follows you throughout the entire mission and just gets in your fucking way. Oh, Joanna, let me see what you're shooting at. Oh. You fucking idiot. Anyway, I've digressed. Back to the matter at hand, which is to fight our way through this pitch black foyer. Get her. Too fucking slow, cunt. Hey, Joseph, can you see her yet? No. Dang shit! You'll pay for that agent Fuck! And now do yourself a massive favour. Get in the elevator, close the door, and leave Dr. Cunt behind. It's going to save us a lot of frustration. And that's objective one completed, as we are now going to take the elevator back up to the office floor. Ah, my fucking eyes! Yeah, and you'd want to take the night vision goggles off too. Can you hear that? That's the sound of that floating, cheap, death-dealing piece of shit that is a Datadyne gunship. It's going to be making our lives hard for the most of this mission. Now that we've reached the first office floor, we must unlock the adjacent elevator to continue moving upward. Sounds simple enough. Target sighted. So's mine. Don't let me! So we'll take out these guards and head through these double doors and make our way down this hallway. Get out of the way, you shotgun toting bitches! Oh, and look, there's that gunship. We got lucky this time and it didn't spot us. So now we'll press on into this room. <laughs> Missed. Now get out of my face! <laughs> Bitch. So now by using this computer, we'll unlock the second elevator. Sweet. That's objective two completed, and now it's time to move upwards. So we'll head to the elevator, cool it down, and head up to the next floor. Oh look, there's Dr. Carroll. He's just in time for us to leave him behind again. See you later, dickhead. Now there are no explicit objectives to complete on this floor, but we simply need to just keep moving. We're going to quickly stop here, equip our CMP, set it to follow lock-on, and use it on these two guards. <laughs> Didn't see that coming, did you, cunts? Now we're gonna switch back to our beastie shotgun. And I can hear that fucking gunship somewhere. Hey, you! Hey, me? Hey, fucking you! Get her. Good luck with that! Oh, great. Now the gunship is onto us. This is gonna fucking hurt. This is what I fucking mean. Look at my health just disintegrate into nothing. Right, now that gunship's got me all pissed off. Time to vent my frustration. Locked and fucking loaded. That's not how it- Oh no, we're too late! Damn yeah. fucking right! You're too late! But thanks for the rocket launcher. That's gonna come in handy. Now, ladies and gentlemen, it is time to complete objective three, which is to finally destroy that fucking gunship. Now we just gotta find it. There it is! Now to equip our- Ah! Not the fucking night vision, the rocket launcher! Now we'll set it to targeted rocket, aim, fire, and blow that motherfucker out of the fucking sky! Yeah! Oh wait, I'm forgetting something. I'm going to kill you, but with something painful. Now, nah. nah. Yep. <laughs> Don't worry, mate. I haven't forgotten about you either. You're gonna cop it too. I implore you to reconsider. <laughs> and now, with almost no health remaining, thanks to that fucking gunship, we can now venture on to the final part of the mission. We meet again, girl. You've become quite an annoyance. Have I, you fucking blue coat wearing slut? Good night, Miss Dark. Good night, bitch. Now here you have two choices. You can throw on your night vision goggles and engage Cassandra's bitches in the darkness, or you could take a different approach. Good night, Miss Dark. So, weren't your bitches wearing night vision goggles? I guess they wouldn't like it if I did this then. Lights are staying on, bitches. You can't hit what you can't see. You didn't think I knew where the light switch was, did you, cunts? Oh, my 
my eyes. I can see again. Good. Just in time to see me blow your fucking head off. Now, there is one more bodyguard. Where the hell could she be? Ah, there you are. And you missed. And that's objective four taken care of. So now all we need to do is head up to the helipad where we started the first mission and we can finally escape this shithole. Joanna, why did you leave me behind? Shut up, cunt. Okay. Going somewhere. Oh, not you again. Yeah, I was. Something what the fuck do you want, your old bag? Return our sapient immediately. You don't know what you're doing. Ah, uh, yeah, I do. I'm fucking leaving, you dumbass. One more chance. Give it back. And you could come and work for me. Huh. <laughs> work for you, or you can go and fuck yourself! See ya, motherfucker! You must get the sapient back. We cannot proceed without it. I know that. I also know who to talk to. Mr. Carrington. I need water. Shut up, Bear Grylls!